Hi, this is Jim from Facilis Technology. I want to talk about a new product called Object Cloud. Object Cloud virtualizes object storage into a cache volume right in your desktop within your Facilis shared storage environment. Now, there's always some questions with cloud storage, like where do my files actually go? How do I upload them? What does it cost to keep them there? How do I restore them back? And does that cost any more when I restore them back to my system? Well, where the files go is up to you. You could have a corporate Azure account through Microsoft, an AWS account through Amazon, or if you buy the service with storage from us, we use a company called Wasabi. And that's important for a reason I'll get to in a moment. As far as how you get the files there, just drag them right onto the cache volume. It's just like any other volume in the system. Or you can schedule it to happen after hours. We offer this integration for a one-time yearly fee that even includes the cloud storage and starts at only $29.90 per year for 10 terabytes. We also offer 50 and 100 terabyte options, and we offer lower cost software only if you have your own account. When it comes time to restore those files back to your project, simply open the file up or drag it into your project volume, drag it from Fast Tracker into your project or timeline. It automatically restores from the cloud location. And how much does it cost to restore all that data from the cloud? Well, if you're using our turnkey storage package, it will cost you nothing. That's the key. We use a no egress cost cloud service. Next, let's look at a couple common workflows you may find in a facility that uses Object Cloud. The first workflow we'll look at is master, upload, and relink. I want to get the master to the cloud as soon as I can. I want to make proxies, and I want to get the masters back for final conform. Let's start with Ingest Workstation. Ingest Workstation can be PC or Mac or Linux. The files are copied directly onto a Facilis virtual volume, which is actually the cache for Object Cloud. As soon as the files are copied to the object storage cache volume, they are immediately uploaded to the cloud of your choice, Azure or AWS if it's your account, and Wasabi if you bought the storage through us. Later on, those files are flushed or purged from the system to save disk space. Before that happens, Fast Tracker Auto Index kicks in and indexes the material to the catalog, creates the proxy directly into the edit source volume. Now there's a proxy for every master file that's available for edit. Through Fast Tracker Desktop Browse, the user can see both the now offline masters that have been uploaded to the cloud and the online proxy version and has access to either one. In Adobe, within Premiere Pro or After Effects, our Fast Tracker panel gives the user access to all of the proxy files into the timeline or into the project directly. After the edit, simply relink to the cache volume. The cache volume contains all of the offline files that are currently on the cloud. During the relinking process, those are all restored from the cloud to the cache volume and made online for the conform. You can choose to either leave the files on the cache volume for access during conform or media manage onto your work volume. When the job is complete, send the project metadata and any approval copies and master outputs to the cloud immediately for archive. Another unique workflow for object cloud is proxy encode and upload. This time the master clips aren't going to the cloud, but the proxies are to make them available to remote workstations and users. The ingest workstation copies the files directly onto the edit source volume. The edit source volume will be used for editing, but Fast Tracker comes in and auto indexes and generates proxies from those original master clips. The proxies land on the object cloud volume. Fast Tracker can provide both a low res preview clip and a full res proxy. The proxies land on the object cloud cache volume and are immediately uploaded to your cloud service of choice or the packaged cloud service with the object cloud feature. Fast Tracker Desktop Browse has access to both the edit source, high res masters, and the proxies as well, whether they be offline or still existing on disk. The Fast Tracker panel within Premiere Pro looks directly at the source volume for the online master clips. If you'd like to use the toggle proxies feature within Adobe Premiere Pro, simply attach the proxies that have already been created from Fast Tracker to the online master clips. Since those proxy files are all uploaded to the cloud, you now have access to any workstation in the world into that interface for the cloud service to download those files.
If any new media or project data was created on the remote workstation, simply upload that through the cloud interface and it's automatically synchronized back into the cloud cache virtual volume. This offers a secure way of accessing files remotely outside the facility without having to give those users access to the internal network via VPN. Next, let's look even closer at how to collaborate with remote workstations through the Object Cloud feature. You may have workstations all over the world that all have access to the cloud service interface for uploading into the cloud directories. Your Object Cloud Virtual Cache Volume can act as a representation of everything in the cloud directory structure, synchronized right into that volume on your desktop. The video and audio data can be restored to the cache volume through an automated prefetch or through the process of auto-indexing and proxy generation within FastTracker. The Adobe editors can utilize either the proxy files generated from FastTracker or the original source media that's still held in cache on the object cloud volume. Users of the desktop browse application have access to both the downloaded masters and the proxies for use in creating catalogs, commenting, tagging with metadata, and approving finished edits from the field. Object Cloud is just one feature of the new award-winning hub shared storage from Facilis Technology. Our hub servers are all new, built from the ground up to be higher performance with better volume management technology and asset tracking than ever before. If you need to get rid of that network attached storage device and need something more robust, or if you're already a Facilis customer using previous generation software and servers, you should take a look at hub shared storage. Thanks for your time.